Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Sister Wives Season 18 Episode 4 A Deal with the Devil showed viewers the Christmas holidays with the Brown family, which left Mary Brown feeling isolated and alone after spending time with her husband Cody Brown and her sister wife Robin Brown. Throughout Sister Wives Season 18, there has been a massive shift in the tone of the family, especially with the departure of Cody's ex-wife Christine Brown. While Cody was still married to Janelle Brown during the Christmas holidays, she chose not to spend her time with their children in a separate location after a huge blowout fight between the pair. While the fallout between Janelle and Cody played a massive part in their demise, it wasn't clear throughout the episode that the couple were over. Cody spent a huge part of the episode with his friend Nathan, who provided a different perspective on how divorce works for a husband with several wives. Although Nathan's perspective was interesting, it pushed Cody to dig in his heels about his situation, making it more difficult to change his mind about Janelle, Christine, or Mary. Throughout Sister Wives Season 18, Cody's relationships with his now ex-wives has been strained, and things only got worse. After their massive blowout fight from Sister Wives Season 18 Episode 3, Cody and Janelle checked in with the Sister Wives cameras about how they were feeling. In a video shot from Janelle's phone, she shared that she was completely blindsided by the argument. She was still angry with Cody for trying to gaslight her throughout the conversation and still hoping to find a bridge to communicate about things in their relationship. Still, Janelle made it clear that she wasn't happy with how Cody had spoken to her, and then went into panic mode about her financial situation. Janelle spoke openly about the fact that she'd sunk the majority of her financial assets into Coyote Pass, the land that Cody and his wives had purchased in order to build their family estate. Sharing that at 50, she had nothing to her name, and wasn't sure how she'd gotten into this mess of a situation. She made it clear that things were not going well. Cody shared that he was still angry from the fight as well. He spoke in an interview segment filmed later, so his emotions were a bit more pulled back, but he shared that his relationship with Janelle was feeling fractured beyond repair. After her fight with Cody, Janelle decided to embrace the Christmas spirit and spent the holiday with her children as planned. The family had rented a house for the occasion, since Janelle's apartment wouldn't fit all of her children traveling in from around the country. Joined by nearly all of her kids, Janelle was thrilled to be spending the holiday with her loved ones, but things were obviously somewhat stilted without Cody in the picture. Throughout their time together, it was clear that Janelle had a lot more on her mind than just the holidays. During their Christmas festivities, Janelle shared with the children that she and Cody had been fighting. While none of the kids were surprised, they did press her for details about what was happening with parents. Janelle didn't want to keep things from the family. She did water the argument down a bit for her children. I kind of told the kids their dad and I had had a really bad fight that we probably weren't coming back from. Janelle shared in an interview segment. My kids weren't surprised. They've observed our relationship for several years and thought maybe it was time for me to do something different, find something better. Christmas at Cody and Robin's house was an elaborate affair with Cody feeling the strain of their family not being all together for the holidays. While Robin spoke during the episode and in the past about her children feeling the weight of Christine's departure, she shared once again that she and Cody were trying to mitigate any strange feelings for the kids surrounding the fact that none of their extended family was around for Christmas. In order to distract the kids, according to Robin, Cody planned an elaborate surprise and purchased all his and Robin's kids' motorbikes. It was clear that his efforts were working as the kids were excited. When Mary got to Cody and Robbins, things got a bit awkward. In an interview segment, Cody acknowledged the fact that things were likely very uncomfortable for Mary when it came to being in close quarters for the Christmas holiday. It's probably very awkward for Mary. This is mine and Robin's house, Cody shared. Robin and I always have to tone down our romantic tension completely. While Mary is deeply aware of Cody and Robin's relationship, her own relationship with Cody is far less intimate.